Hey guys, so in this video, I bring to you very interesting opportunity from Adobe India. So in this, they are going to give you a scholarship worth equivalent of your fees of third year and final year and also an opportunity to work as an intern in next year in Adobe only if you get selected. So before we get ahead, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. You can just go on our channel and subscribe. We post lots of workshops every day, Git, Cyber Hub, Cyber Security, sorry, Cloud Computing, Internships, Openings and lots of hackathons, competitions, every Thing you will get all at one place so don't forget to subscribe to our channel so let's continue it's a adobe india women in technology scholarship so it's just an incentive for girl child to pursue their career achieve a lot of things in their technological journey so only the girls who are passed it's not for boys it's only for girls who are graduating in 2023 that is they are in their third year or about to go in their fifth semester that is third year so only those students can watch the video if you are from different batch different year you can just skip if you are a junior if you are a second year or first year girl you can definitely watch this video because you will get an idea how this is going to work because this happens every year we also did it last year we also last year posted as well so you can join our youtube channel because whenever it's going to come for you we will update you okay so let's understand what's happening in it so adobe's women in tech is a scholarship which uh, helps to improve participation of women in tech what are you going to get you will get fund toward tuition fee for the remainder of the award recipients university education ending in year 2023 opportunity for summer internship at 2022 it's not mandatory that you will get internship at all because if you get selected for this you will get fees waiver but you will get internship or not it depends okay mentoring by senior uh, you can go to grasshopper conference and all these things a specialist of adobe will review your uh, process that we are going to talk about that uh, there will be two or three rounds of interview okay so let's look at the eligibility criteria indian female citizen enrolled in any college btech or mtech of any branch any uh, stream okay you have to be passed out of 2023 batch major and minor in the following cs computer science engineering information science data science electrical electronics engineering math and computing so uh, mechanical civil girls are not allowed only these branches students are allowed i early said this that is wrong i take it back may apply to only one of the following two scholarships they are giving you two options women in tech scholarship or adobe global women in technology scholarship so i hope you must fill for the first one india women in technology scholarship only people who are related to any adobe employee are not eligible to apply these are the relations which are mentioned so if you, any of your relative is in Ad adobe and you fall in this category then you cannot apply how to apply uh, last date to apply is 22nd august application is started 27th of july 5 pm and it will end at 5 pm 22nd of august so you have plenty of time okay what you have to write in application you have to write essays to there are five questions that you have to answer that we will discuss in the video further you have to create your resume updated letter of recommendation from professor this is very important because as you can see they are giving you a uh, fees waiver they are giving your tuition fees so they want to be sure that you are enrolled in any college and and you are an authentic student of that college so you have to bring a lor letter of recommendation from a professor with whom you have taken a college course any associate professor assistant professor mostly students bring from hod so wherever you want whoever you want you can do and you can submit it up to 4th of september last date is 22nd so but you can give it up to 4th of september as it is written here academic transcripts from your current institution you need to give some mark sheet etc for btech only i checked the whole application there is no space for school as well but if they ask you can just provide them the 10 10 12 mark sheet of yours okay more details are posted on the application portal let's go to the application portal same thing we discussed uh, go here click here to big so in this i have already created an account you can just simply create an account with your email id and password your name okay so make sure you provide your updated email id because that's written there you cannot change your name and email id later okay so please be sure that you are able to fill it properly let's look at what you have to fill name email university type of degree uh, when it is completing year of completion grading point major department country of uh, residence these are the normal stuff you can fill uh, data share consent you have to just accept it you have to then upload your resume slash cv okay and your transcripts which are your mostly uh, mark sheet etc 
recommend reference for letter of recommendation this is important you have to add the name of professor and the email id most probably you will give the official college email id at the rate whatever your college is so please take consent from the uh, professor and don't just add without taking consent because they will send an email to that person that like this student has applied and given your recommendation so do you know or do you not know okay so please make sure you tell that person tell that professor tell that hod that i am giving your reference so please don't uh, just they give it like that okay so the most important part are these essay questions there are five questions you have to answer a b c d e let me explain to you in brief what each you have to do in question a you have to state your future goals the technology challenges you are passionate about skill you are working like data science android web development you can talk about that what you want to do in this domain you can see create like i want to create a software that will solve some problem i want to join a company uh, where i will unlock my potential and learn a lot of things so these kind of things you can write and your personal motivation is to pursue the field of technology you can give some anecdote like i was in inspired by that person that event that i came to this direction so this is how you can write it you have to write it under 200 words please take these essay questions very seriously because adobe takes them very seriously while reviewing your application next is describe an event that has impacted your life either in a negative or positive way if the same event were to recur would you uh, what would you do differently and why this is a complex question please think they please think of original something please don't copy from google or quora okay think of some original event from your life that has impacted you negative positive way like failing in sub subject or passing away of some family member or some tragic thing happened when you went on tour or something like that you can write these kind of uh, situations if you have anything else that you can also write just make sure you write it properly with proper grammar and no uh, spelling errors okay and also give proper spaces like <laughs> no space before comma after comma dot this the collected so take care of those things okay next why do you think are you deserving of the adobe, adobe wit scholarship what unique qualifies do you bring and what do you expect in return so you already do what is they are offering you so just return i want to learn i want to explore i want to get motivated by connected with like minded people and how corporate is uh, more friendly to women how it can become what are the improvement this kind of things i want to know in the return part what unique qualities like i am passionate hard working i am Uh, if i put in my mind something i always achieve it these kinds of things you have to write because you have to see what is unique about you i can't tell you okay why do you think you are deserving of the adobe wit scholarship because same uh, it's part of the second question as well so you have to frame point from this and answer the first part in 200 words so you have to write write it in other document like some microsoft word or some uh, whichever editor you are using first write it there fix all the errors and then paste it here also check your word count you will find lot of tools which will help you in checking your word count there is less representation of women in tech what challenges have you faced or anticipate facing in your pursuit of field of technology you can talk about these things if you are aware of them and you can also think what can be the possible challenge to you in person or in general in by women in tech This is an interesting question who is the role model that you look up to describe this person and why do you consider that person as a role model up you can also take my name and you can write why are you inspiring inspired for me <laughs> i'm just kidding so you can take name of any person you are inspired from and describe why you look up to them uh, describe that person ki wo kya karta hai which field they belong to and why do you consider that person as a role model for yourself so it's a simple answer 75 words they just want to uh evaluate your creativity i would recommend if you find someone from the tech world that will be more helpful because it is for women in technology if you are inspired from someone from technology field then it will be more beneficial than any actor actress sports person or anyone but tech field will be better and apart from that it's your choice okay multimedia submission you can submit some video link as well it is optional it is not mandatory but i would recommend you to create some video upload it on youtube on your channel and make the video unlisted and then add the link of it in this section when you click on edit all of this will become editable okay so you can add your link here so there is no need to hurry to fill this form last date is 22nd of august please take time please think all the answers write it in word get it reviewed by some person some bhaiya some didi which you uh, understand like which you uh, take advice from okay and get their feedbacks and then 
fill it okay every year lot of girls get it okay so i think around 40 50 100 student must be getting it i don't know the exact number but you can find from google or youtube etc some estimation but it will be in two two digits only that's how these companies uh, offer their scholarship program so give it your best there will be tests written and lots of interviews you can read lots of uh, experiences on gfg of amazon adobe wit because very famous it's been here from uh, last two three years okay so all the best and fill your from